I want to thank everybody for coming. Uh, I feel incredibly lucky that we have this broad segment of folks who are important to Equipoise here. We're very lucky to have a mission that gets us up in the morning, which is to take this wonderful technology that uh, Garrett Brown originated and morph it into something that helps people be safer and more productive. Uh, no matter whether they're on a factory floor or a doctor treating a patient or a person who's fighting disabilities or members of our armed services out in the field. And it's my pleasure to introduce them. Well, thank you, Eric. That was a very generous introduction. And more importantly, thank you for staying in the city of Los Angeles. Named the most innovative company in North America by International Business, recipient of the Los Angeles Business Journal's Patrick Soon Chung Innovation Award, winning the Brit Week Award for Innovation. And businesses like this that are innovative, that are technology driven, are the future. I want to thank you for, again, staying in the city of Los Angeles. It's great. This is a win, win, win situation. You know, seize the moment is what Mike Tai says. And what Eric and his folks in the room here have done has, has taken the moment. Here you go. <laughs> when you see Patrick, who doesn't waste any money or invest in anything stupid, you know that you're in the right spot at the right time. And boy, when you walk in here and see the potential applications from a health perspective of this technology, you are on a cutting edge, you are on the beginning of something that is so exciting that the entire world will benefit from this. On behalf of the city of Los Angeles, I want to welcome you uh, to this 11th Council District. Congratulations on the grand opening and the move to a larger facility in Playa Vista. We wish your company many years of success producing innovative zero gravity arm technology, and I'm sure other parts of the body technology, to reduce workplace injuries and to increase productivity. We're fortunate to have you here and look forward to seeing the company grow in the district, in the city, in the nation, and in the world. And we're lucky to have Missy Brost, who is the manager of, of ergonomic technologies, which this is, for the Boeing company, to say a few words. About four years ago, I guess, we had a number of ergonomists at the Applied Ergonomics Conference when this technology was unveiled. And we had four sites jump on board immediately. And we piloted that technology. And I'm proud to say we were their first customer. We worked with Equipoise over the years to develop different ways to use their technology to create uh, interfaces, whether it be for a large drill motor for a major structural join or a uh, overhead sandy equipment that our customers have been very interested in. Thank you, Jesse. Boeing was indeed our very first customer and remains uh, a terrific customer, and we collaborate with them very closely. Um, in LA, in the private sector, there really is no stronger supporter of innovation and companies like us than Dr. Patrick Soon Chong. I think this is an incredible um, opportunity, and, and May was asking why uh, we got involved here. Um, and with Eric's permission, uh, this company will morph into what we call the zero G bionics. And as you see, the uh, underlying technology with uh, inventors like Garrett, I think epitomizes where we are going as a nation and where we're going as a world, that you actually take technology that sits in a different discipline, the entertainment industry, and you take um, technology that actually is going to work in the manufacturing industry and convert that also into the health and, 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 and the opportunity to create what I call this amazing convergence. One thing we have as a nation is innovation. And I don't think anybody can beat us with innovation. So the idea would be if you can combine innovation with manufacturing skills and next generation electronics and microelectronics and nanophotonics and bring them all together into one little area, and I think equipoise truly epitomizes that. You know, Ms. May, we've not talked about that yet, but we have a vision. We can't let Silicon Valley in Northern California dominate. We want to create Silicon Beach. I love so, that. <laughs> I love that. This is the beginning of that, and I, I thank you for your support, and thank you, Councilman, for your support. 
and really looking forward to great things from this organization. Thank you.